Good morning, everybody. This is Rich Caney down along the river, Richest Smokers, West Virginia. You know, it's been a while since we did a cooking video, but we're back up on it. So what we're going to do today is since the Thanksgiving season is coming and we haven't cooked on a new cooker, well, we're going to go ahead and do a turkey. And we injected it up last night um, just to get it done. Everybody knows how to inject a turkey. But my sponsor, one of my sponsors for the barbecue team, Bill Ames at Make It Meaty, um, he has an awesome injection. You should check it out. You have to buy it off Amazon, or you can hit him up. His email will be on makeitmeaty.com. There at the bottom, Make It Meaty. This makes one quart. Um, he's a food technologist, like a food scientist. And he has um, a couple products out there that are just amazing for the competition world, or not even the competition world. You can be a not in competition and use them. What this Make It Media is, it is a f um, flavor enhancer and a moisture retention um, solution. You can mix it with chicken broth. You can use it in beef, any meat you want. Mix it however you want. He also has a couple other products that... It is Savory Premium. You'll see that on his website. Um, now this is a little secret. It's a yeast extract. Um, you know, it, it is um, a lot of salt. Um, a serving is two tablespoons and it's like 2,300 milligrams of salt. You sell on Nutrition Facts. But, you know, here he is, distributed by Make It Meaty, State College, Pennsylvania, makeitmeaty.com. Or if you want to purchase, you can either purchase off him or you can go to Amazon, Google Make It Meaty on Amazon, and you, know, you can find it there. He also, instead of using chicken broth, he has sent me a test run of his chicken powder, um, just called Chicks. Um, this is my, my little gift. But so we mixed up a, you know, water, it was just water, um, make it meaty packet, three tablespoons of the chicken thing, the chicken powder, and two tablespoons of the make it, of uh, the savory premium. And we also mixed in, everybody have heard of Michael Petrie's, it's incredible. We put a little bat in there for a little onion, garlic, little herbs, and you can find this incredible product <laughs> at heavenmadeproducts.com. I'll leave a link below. He is my co-packer, um, and he makes, um, right now, he makes my rub. So, not only did we put that in the injection, we rubbed it on the outside of the bird, just dusted a little bit, and I know it's covered up with tape, but this is Rich's River Dirt, my rub, all-purpose. Um, it said all-purpose right there, but I had it in the competition trailer, and I put duct tape around it for thinking it's a secret. Oh, that's stupid, right? So we injected that turkey, dusted the turkey last night. So now we're going to go out and get the cooker fired up. So we'll see outside and we'll show you our new cooker that we sold, that we got um, for vending, roadside barbecue, and next year's competitions. So we'll see you outside. All right, guys, we're outside and we have everything going. Let's look at this new cooker. All right, guys, and there she is. I'm iron mixing 48 inch H2O. Look at this thing. This thing is a beast. We got the water in there. It's ready to go. And this thing is fantastic. So we got our coals over there. What we're going to do is we'll just dump the coals in that basket, put a piece of that wood on. It's sliding in the firebox. All right, guys, the best part about this cooker that I like is this. The automated water service has a hose hooked to it. And as it boils, it just keeps feeding it. I think it's fantastic. So we have our wood in. You can see it in there. It's just doing its thing. And... So, 
We'll get this thing warmed up and we'll get that turkey All on. Alright guys, we have our mixing at about 275 on this side. 275 on that side. Look at that turkey. That thing looks great. So we're going to put this on today with a little bit of hickory wood. And we'll see you in about an hour. Boys, we got that thing in the mixing's at 325 on the right side. We're cooking a brisket for a friend. At the same time, we're cooking a turkey. 300 on a turkey. And, yeah, man, we got that water pan just a boiling. Check that thing out. That thing is, this machine is badass. So, guys, you know, deal with me getting used to it. So, whew, man, thing is bad. All right, folks, we just wrapped up that brisket. But let's take a look at this turkey. I'll tell you what, this turkey is looking phenomenal. Ugh. I think it's looking good. As you can see in there, looking pretty good. So, next time I'll take the top rack out. So, we're looking at about 133. We still got, oh, I'd say probably, probably another two hours, maybe 30 degrees. I'm cooking at 165 in the breast. So, we'll see you. Guys, I'm gonna tell you what, man. This this Meyer mixing is top of the line. I mean, I thought the backwoods was good, and I thought the drum was the thing to have. But I tell you what, the moisture this pit puts out—it's a little maintaining. I mean, you gotta put a stick on it every half hour or so. But I tell you what, though, man, the the product. Uh, you know, we cooked pork butts on a test run with it, and we cooked ribs, and I decided to go ahead, you know, and do our turkey cook on it. Um, and yeah, I tell you what, man, it's 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 a nice pit. I'm not just saying that because you know um, I have one, but I found this thing on Marketplace, and it was a hell of a deal. You know, I couldn't pass it up. So, you know. We are, like I said, we're doing roadside next year. You know, we're doing a little bit of everything. So, we got a lot of videos coming up. This is my soul cooker. I will not cook on anything else except for this one right now. Uh, we still got a pit barrel, and that's all I got. And a Green Mountain Grill, it's on the fritz. Got to take it to the shop. Um, so, you know, just, it's it's badass. So, go to MeyerMixingSmokers.com. You know, check out. It's a little pricey. The uh, only reason I got the 48, again, I found a good price on Marketplace. So, and this is our first YouTube cook on it, and I hope that turkey turns out. And remember, if you're going to inject any meat, go to makeitmeaty.com, check out Bill Ames' site, and, and, and get you some off Amazon. He has other products, too. We'll be using those in the future, so stick with us. All right, folks, our bird is done. Here, I had to wrap it in a foil because it was getting a little dark for my liking. Look at that. Look at this all thing. Right, the turkey is done. It's a little dark. That's all right. We'll take that. That's why I had to put the little foil over it. But I think it is juicy. Look at that. So, look at this thing inside. Leave it rest for half hour and we'll uh, do what do, do, do we do with it. There it is, folks. The test run turkey on the Myron. I know it looks a little dark, but that's really how it turned out, which I don't really mind. And we'll see how it tastes, but, uh, you know, what the hell. So, uh, it's resting. We'll slice it up and add some uh, contraments to it. We're going to do one breast of barbecue sauce and well, the way it is. So, we'll get back with you. All right, folks, it's time to, I know we got a horrible light in here, but it's time to slice into this chicken, chicken breast. Uh, really? And yeah. turkey? Yeah. Let's take the leg off. See what the score is. Lay that off to the side there. Look at the juice. Holy shit. It is crazy. It is pouring out of it. Yeah, it is. Let's 
So we'll get a taste of this here. Which I think when I will cut it. <laughs> see it. <laughs> you can see it. Wow. All right, let's grab a taste of this thing and see what it tastes like with that make it media injection. Here we go. Oh, wow. That is fantastic, guys. Oh, man. Hmm. That's on my shirt. Trademark. Guys, if you ever heard of making me to go to his website and check it out. So we're going to carve his turkey up and we're going to serve it up for lunch. So I'll leave all my links in the description box to show more. Share with your friends and family in the world. And when you do share with them, tell them the best barbecue comes from the river. And we'll see you on the next one. I'm going to do a PS, guys. I'm telling you, the turkey was in the freezer from last year. And you really have to, would have had to been in the kitchen to appreciate the juiciness of that, that turkey. Oh, my God. Whew. I mean, it was fantastic. I mean, it was juicy. You could taste you know, the turkey flavor. I tell you what, man, that make it meaty. Check it out. Makingmeaty.com. The link will be in the description box. Mixing H2O. That water cooker is unlike any other water cooker I've ever cooked on. The moisture was there. The brisket's almost done. It's my buddy wants me to cook for him. And I can't wait to try that. It had no making meaty in it. But I just want to see the difference between, you know, butcher barbecue injection, which is that what's what has that in it. And make it meaty and the, the cooker. So, guys, check it out. This is fantastic. It feels good to be back. So, I might, get, I might be a little rusty at making the videos. This Katie was manning the camera. So, guys, you know, this is a PS video. So, thanks for hanging around. Thanks for the support. And we'll definitely see you soon.